uh, Lean 341, I'll just uh, briefly uh, show you how what I did with uh, this word languages. Uh, so with respect to the word languages, you here have, um, let's listen to it first. Okay, it should be good. Oops. Languages, languages, languages. Yeah, and this part here uh, should be voiced, right? Uh, because you understand that this is languages. It's a uh, plural of language with the morpheme is. So it should be voiced, but when we hear it, it's not, right? So the greatest part of this consonant or yeah, yeah, this consonant is not voiced. It's actually voiceless. There is a small part here. In fact, oops, like this amount that it's vo that it, it is voiced. So if I play it from here, there is a little bit of voiced, uh, a slight voiced portion of it. So around yeah, too much. Yeah, I'd say around. What's that? Uh, mm, get selection length 30, 35 uh, milliseconds of voice portion, while the rest is uh, like 220 or 0 0.2 seconds of uh, voices portion. So yeah, that's how you can see whether something is voiced or voiceless. There are also here a slight, um, like, uh, slight shades of voicing bars. We call those voicing bars, like in this one, this is one of voicing bar, this is another, this is another, and this is the, the vowel. Uh, this part of, this portion of S or Z, uh, is slightly voiced because of these vo voicing bars as well. So you, this is a clue or a cue to voicing. Uh, with respect to um, uh, uh, the voiceless R and L, yeah, I'll lose maybe I'll lose this one. I just need this portion here. So I recorded something like this. Pray, pray. It's not the best recording, but it will do. So. What we have here, uh, we, we, you know, the waveform goes all the way up and down because of the uh, loudness. I was too loud for this, but it doesn't really matter. It it still uh, exemplifies the voiceless uh, R. And this portion of P is aspirated, as you can see and hear. Uh, the aspiration goes all the way through the uh, through the consonant, and that's why the consonant becomes uh, voiceless. So, and there is a small portion of this consonant. Yeah, too loud. That is a small portion of a consonant which is voiced. So it's not actually completely voiceless, but still we can put this little diacritic like zero beneath it, beneath uh, the uh, the voice. Uh, voiceless portion, right? Um, that's one I recorded. The other one I also play. recorded. It's play instead of pray this time. So oops. Uh, for this one, I'll get, I'll have p, p and the aspiration here that. Oops, I'm showing one of the same thing. Here it is. So here it is. Still the same. And there is a l laterality a little bit, so as if I'm, yeah, uh, spitting a little bit, and then there is a small portion of, of the consonant that is voiced as well. So the same thing uh, applies to uh, pray and play, right? And this was just a short, short video of showing you this. Uh, and how it goes.